that was my first fire, so it was a little stressful for me, but when you're in the moment, you don't really think about it. Well, we know this first responders really put their lives on the line every day and tonight in our special report on Connecticut's bravest Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan is introducing us to several heroes who risked their lives to save the life of an elderly woman. On Thursday, September 23rd, about 643 in the evening, Mystic Fire got a 911 call about a fully involved house fire here on Somerset Drive. Ground for alarm to the Mystic Fire Department responding 97 Somerset Drive uh, building fire. A report of a bed on fire in the residence. This was the first working fire for Mystic's newly named chief, Tony Manfredi, as well as firefighter Heather Bennett. So it was a little stressful for me, but when you're in the moment, you don't really think about it. I'm getting reports of a woman in the house. But knowing that we had a victim that was uh, reported in the back bedroom, we sent the search crew in first and the hose line immediately behind them. Mystic Fire knew the house and the woman inside, 92-year-old Georgette DeCandia. She had a lift chair on the front stairway, so a decision was made to send the rescue team through the back door and into thick, choking smoke. Oh, you can't see your hand in front of your face, um, contrary to you know what you see on TV and things like that. Our team had some walls and barriers in front of us, and we overcame every single one of them as a team. I heard my fellow firefighters calling, we found her, we found her. So I made my way to where they were. As they were starting to pull her out, I met them in the hallway. We brought her out of the building, um, started CPR outside, and uh, turned her over to Mystic River Ambulance. As EMTs rushed the 92-year-old woman to l &M Hospital, they got a pulse, but she expired the next day from her injuries. I hope that the family got to say their goodbyes, and that's all we could ask for. Several of the first responders, including Chief Manfredi, said after they made entry, they never heard a smoke detector going off. Also, they later determined that the cause of the fire was improperly discarded smoking materials. Tonight, those firefighters who answered the call are all being called heroes for risking their own lives to save others. With the Mobile Newsman Mystic, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.